Holy smokes guys, it is freaking hot. But welcome back to another episode of Fish in Florida. Today I'm going to probably be fishing the big lake in my neighborhood. It's pretty clear, it's a pretty sick lake. It might be really weedy. It usually is in the summer, but hopefully it won't be too weedy. I'm going to probably use a lizard and hopefully get some big fish. Yesterday I actually caught this giant. I'll show you guys that right now. All right guys, just got this solid. 5.2 really pretty I love this clear water because all the fish here look so pretty but yeah that's a big one let's get that release oh my gosh so yeah that was a pretty big fish but today hopefully I'll get one that big or even bigger we'll see what happens but I'm gonna be fishing with Dakota and hopefully we'll get a ton of fish let's actually let's just get to the spot and get to fishing okay guys made it to the spot I got a Senko tied on the bullet weight and hopefully we can get some fish we'll see what happens oh he got stuck in the first bass of the day hopefully y'all can hear it's kind of windy okay well first bass of the day he hit it once threw back out there and he hit it again little guy hopefully we can get some bigger ones but i'm gonna get a release oh my gosh he went crazy. There he goes. Oh my god. My GoPro's on. That was sick. Oh my gosh. That's a big snake. Holy smokes. That blow up. I didn't get the blow up. But guys, I switched to a frog rod. Got my speed demon. And I'm using a cheap frog. That's a good one. Let's go. All right, guys. Just got this solid. He says eight. I'd say probably around eight, two. That's a good snake head. Mm -hmm. I missed the blow up because I wasn't expecting to get a fish. But it was a sick blow up and a sick jump, too. That's a good one. All right, let's get a release. There he goes, biggin'. Oh, there's a snake head. No, he's going away from my frog. Oh! Oh my gosh, another one. I know, I thought it was bigger too. That's still another good one. Dude, I saw him swirling out there, cast it at him. He was going the opposite direction, then he just turned around and crushed it. Another solid snake. This one's probably like a six. Another good one, crushed the frog. That was a sick blow up. I think I got, I think I got that all in GoPro. Hopefully, let's get a release. Ready, bud? These gnats are crazy. Yeah, I know. There you go. Another good one. Sorry, Sean, should I bring two rods? I yeah, I brought two. Okay, I don't bring two. All right, guys, it is the next day. We are now going to try to catch some peacock, hopefully. We're gonna buy live bait and we're going to, yeah. all right, so yeah, we're gonna buy live bait, go to a new spot. We don't know if it has peas, but it looks pretty juicy. And if it doesn't, We'll just use live bait anyways to hopefully catch some big bass or snakehead. We'll see what happens. See you guys at the spot. I got it. Okay guys, we made it to the spot. A little switch up. We couldn't get live bait, so we're just gonna use jerk baits. But hopefully we'll still get some peas. We'll see what happens. We should be able to get a few. If not, we'll switch to like Senkos and stuff. And definitely we'll get some bass then. But let's get to fishing. Did you not see that? Oh my god, right when the thing in jumped in, I, I got him. Nice. Let's go. Nice. Bring him here. Bring him here. Let's go. Oh my gosh, finally. First pee of the day, guys. Let me, let me get him unhooked. That took a while. Oh, you don't have to get him unhooked. Finally, that took forever. All right, guys, I might have found a pattern. I just got two fish right in a row. One I lost, the other I just got. Sick. Little guy. About a pound. 
maybe pound and a half. I was just reeling yeah, it as fast on. as I could. Let's get a release. It's all little P. Just got a few pictures. Yo, let's hopefully get some more. That was sick. There he goes. Digging. Alright guys, pea fishing did not work out. We only caught one. We got a few bites, but not really that many. Yeah. All the bites we had were pretty small. So yeah, now we're gonna go home. Probably won't fish today anymore. So see you tomorrow. All right guys, day number three. The past few days I've been trying some new stuff. I went for a snakehead in the big lake. It's a really weedy lake, kind of hard to catch fish out of. And I used a frog and that worked decently. And then the day after that we tried a new lake and we used jerk baits and tried to catch peas. We only caught one, but that's how it goes. Anyways, today we're doing what we usually do, which is use Texas rigs at this lake that we go to a lot. And hopefully we should get a ton of bass. We know the spot pretty well and we can usually put a hammer down on these fish. So let's get to it. Let's yeah, hopefully guys. get a ton. Okay guys, I just got a new spinning reel. Do I have one? No. It is from Sugayo. I don't know how to say their name, but I'll leave the link to it in the description. It's a pretty cool spinning reel. So far, I love it. it Cast really smooth, and it reels really nice. So yeah, overall, right now I really love it. We'll see once I start catching a few more fish on it, but so far it's great. Dude, there's a fish right there. Got him. Hey, first bass of the day from a wacky rig. First little bass of the day. All right, I'll do an underwater release just because he said that. No way. Double. Double. All right, well, we just doubled up. You seen him. I thought he just goes like, got him. You think that's gone. Another bass. Alrighty, guys. That's like the second, wait, third fish of the day. Look where I hooked him. The That's perfect spot. Right in the top of the noggin. Okay, guys. Another little bass. Long one. Keaton. Yeah. You're coming to soccer with us. Got him. That's a toad, guys. Big in. How did he even eat my Senko? I am using a pretty small Senko, but seriously. That is a tiny bass. Let's throw him right in that little pocket. I told you a fish was there. Dude, it's huge. Oh my god. That's a toad. I had one. Only studs in this house, guys. Only studs. Biggin. It's a toad. Oh, it's actually not that bad of a fish. Another little bass, really skinny one. Got one. On the lizard. First one on the lizard, just switch. Yeah, and first bass. That was my first cast with a lizard. All right, there we go. That's a pretty one, it's still skinny. That's weird. Usually the bass here are pretty fat, but let's get a release. Oh, oh, I thought he was gonna jump. Got him. Let's go. Another bass on the lizard. That was sick. He crushed it. All right, there we go. Finally, a chunky one. Big him. There he goes. I wanna go. Got him. Yes. Yes. Another bass. 
There he goes. Alrighty, folks, that is going to do it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. It was pretty fun. I finally got on some fish. The past few days, I've been trying some new stuff, some new spots, and new tactics. And that was working decently. I caught some good snakehead and finally got a pea on artificial. I was using a dirt bait. But yeah, that's gonna do it. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time on the next episode of Vision Florida.